Knicks hosting the Los Angeles Clippers, Carmelo Anthony, sporting the celebrating Black History Month tee. Find that on NBA.com. But early on in the stands, Charles Oakley, Knicks legend, uh, having some issues with security. This would get a little ugly. You'll be escorted out by security. You see Oak getting a little bit physical. Doris Burke reports that Oakley came to the game and behaved in a highly abusive manner and was arrested by police. More to come on that story. But early on, the Clippers, you saw Blake knock down the three. Then he gets the leaner and won 18 points in the first quarter. Carmelo, nice pull up. Cut away. Where's Phil Jackson? He's on the phone. I can only imagine what is going on on that conversation. Tied at 36. Oh, DeAndre. With the assist from Mr. Sub-Zero. At least that's what Austin Rivers wanted to be called back in the day. I don't know about it anymore. Uh, Clippers up by one at halftime. Then Derrick Rose with the buzzer beater as the shot clock expires. Knicks up. Crossover. Excuse me. Carmelo nice with it. Knicks up by six. How about this one? Woo-woo. Spike. Yo, Spike. Yeah, Spike likes that. Phil, maybe he does. Who knows what's going through Phil's head? We know who's going to make threes. J.J. Reddick drains it. That would tie it at 107. Two minutes in the fourth. Where's the unicorn off the pick and roll from Derrick Rose? With authority, big man. Fans love that. And off the miss. Cleaning up the mess, DeAndre. Clippers up by four. Last chance for the Knicks. Carmelo's going to get the nice look at the top of the key, but it will fall just a little bit short. Clippers in control. Spike Lee just happened to be wearing his Charles Oakley socks. How convenient. Knicks lose to the Clippers, 119-115. to 